Hi, my name is Jess Meldrum from Keymetrics and welcome to today's episode of Two Minute Tuesdays. In today's episode, we're going to explore filters and parameters in web reports. Filters and parameters are quite common in web reports. Whilst they both have a similar role, their functionality is slightly different. To begin, let's take a look at filters. Filters allow you to restrict the report to a specified element. I'm going to drag in Australia from location into the filters. When I run the report now, it's only going to be filtered for Australia. However, what you will notice is that it doesn't actually allow you to select which location you'd like to run the report for, as a filter is essentially just a fixed rule. It can also be difficult for the end user to see that the report is filtered for Australia, unless it was actually specified. Parameters, on the other hand, behave the same as filters, however, they also prompt the end user to select a location. Let's go in and add a parameter. Parameters actually need to be a filter before it can be moved across to the parameters box. Now if I drag in location next to time parameter and rerun the report, we will get the option to select a location. As we can see, it's defaulting to Australia. However, if I select the drop down, I can now expand Australia and select an individual state. Let's run for Vic. Now we can see the report is running for Vic. That's it for today's episode. As always, if you'd like to know more details or get further assistance, please reach out. Thanks and bye for now.